Well guys, all I can say is we are about to go pick up the new planner. And if you guys haven't heard, Mischler, Mischler, Mischler Farms, Mischler Farms or something like that, won the giveaway. Message me, Mischler, and come claim your Xbox One S. If not, it's going up for a giveaway again. Um, and so, okay, dude, we got issues. We got issues. I got, like, I can't, I can't figure out what type of tractor to get. I I kind of figured out what type of planner you get. So we're going to tab in the 7810. Now, I got to finish up disking that. Dude, we're just on a roll today. We have so many things to get done. I don't always say that every video. But the 7810, our problem is, is it doesn't have enough horsepower to pull the planter I got. There is no tractor we own that has enough horsepower to pull the planter I have. So what we're going to decide is we are going to decide between a 7R or a 90 john deere 9400 okay here, here here let me step out quick and then i gotta jump back in the tractor we gotta keep going boys we gotta keep going hey dude if you're enjoying this let me know by hitting that like button this is probably gonna be a fast paced one as you can see i'm talking like insanely quick so what i could do is i could get a 7r which these are perfect for this would be perfect for this planner i could get a 7310 okay it cost me a hundred eighty seven thousand dollars of course we don't have the money wow we are losing a lot of money right now um but anyways it it would run at 310 horse we need 200 horsepower to run this uh new planter or and i haven't even showed you the planter yet or i could get a 9400 for a lot cheaper price they're older they're used i would run this on the planter it'd be huge tractor no i don't know if it'd be good you know i it's 312 horsepower technically in real life i looked it up it's like 425 horsepower so this would be this would get the job done easily for a cheaper price or i could go new but i don't know i don't know if you guys want i feel like this is almost too new for you guys yet just yet it would be sweet though I, it's not a big tractor it'd just be pretty darn it'd be brand new so that's 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 our two choices 9400 or 7310 is what it's coming down to um i could have got a different brand but we sold a john deere so i was like we sold john deere let's buy a john deere when we sell the case ih we'll buy a case ih when we sell little blue if we ever do we'll buy new holland we'll buy a bigger little oh, I, was, I was about to say we'll buy a bigger little blue now we'll buy a big blue we'll buy big blue then um okay we're just getting this done dude too bad i didn't have a new, big new holland um we can put on land all match colors perfectly Okay, I'm going to drop this down again, and you know what? I was going to hire out a worker. I think is what I, was what I was going to do, but I don't need a worker hired out because I gotta, I'm got i going to use the 7810 to go pick up the planter back in town quick, so that's what we're going to be doing today. It's not going to be, it's not going to look good because the 7010 is just all dirty, and then we're just picking up this shiny new planter, but I feel like the planter is like too big to where it's going to be tough to pull with the truck is what we got going on here. Okay, we're turning pretty tight here. Um... We got to finish this and then that's why I want to get I want to get I want to get the disc off of here Then we can get planting a lot because we still have a lot of work to do to get fully planned I feel like we've been disking forever. I feel like we've been in spring for a while What it's been the past like three videos or so and man, I gotta switch I gotta switch to a new map or something Man, we've been on this map for what this is episode number 28. So oh my gosh, but hey, we're deciding between 9400 or the 7310 is what we got going right now um, and then, I don't know, either one, if I got the, let's see, if I got this uh, 7310, what I'd do is i put that on a grain cart, a newer grain cart we get this year, and if I got the 9400, it'd just be a big, like, tillage and cultivator ta uh, tractor and then plant uh, planting tractor, too. Um, and then, because if I got the 9400, I'd, I'd still, I'd throw the 7810 on a grain cart, th this tractor on a grain cart, that's what we'd do. The 9400 is a lot older tractor. It kind of goes with the style we're playing. 70, 7R would be, man, that'd be that'd be kind of new for us. We wouldn't be, I don't know. I don't think a lot of you guys want me to get a new tractor. That's why I kind of left it up to you guys. And so how I do that is top comment will win it is what we'll do. Top comment wins it usually. Just whoever gets the top most likes basically is the one that'll win. Um, okay. There we go. We're just kind of going back and forth just real quick here with, 70, with the 7010 here. Dude, and then we're going to, I guess we're going to, Okay, so I feel like the 7010 and the 7R are basically the same size of tractor, right? Like, they seem like the same size, but that 7R, a new 7R, is like a ton more horsepower. And actually, Kuzai Farms, if you guys know Kuzai Farm, he watches, uh, or he, I think they have a 7R for a planning tractor too, which I feel like a lot of people have 7Rs for uh, planning tractors, so that's why I thought it might go good. Helper J has completed their task, so what that is, Helper J is that 4755 planting potatoes. So they just finished planting potatoes. Do I want to plant potatoes on something new? I could. I could, I don't know where yet. So 
we have what two fields planted we still got a lot to go though and one thing i can do now that i got this new planner which you guys i still haven't showed yet you guys are probably just skipping ahead don't skip ahead come on come on don't skip ahead man um but don't uh but we need to get um i was gonna sell that the other john Deere 1760 planner you know the one i literally just bought and it's on the magnum right now or no maybe it's off the magnum but i could sell that because the planner i'm getting will has the option to plant wheat so i'm like oh well i don't need that smaller planner then so we'll just get a huge planner and we have a huge okay since you give over probably skipped ahead it's a db60 it's pretty big i'm pretty sure it's 24 row i think it's 24 row i haven't like actually looked at it in game yet but it was the only one i see i wanted to get like a 16 or 18 row it just i couldn't find any good mod out there and stuff so we had to go with 24 row i wasn't going to a 12 row that was going to be too small unfortunately like we'll get it knocked out i maybe 12 row would have been good because look at this we'll just get this knocked out so quick through here but that's kind of how it is i guess it's just gonna be a lot and we got new ground this year and we're gonna keep expanding so it's good for the like the next um upcoming years too that, that's what's nice about it um okay we're on 9.5 mono right now and then we got let's see oh dude do we have some down there yeah we gotta get to oh i think we do okay i'm just gonna make the turn here quick usually i can turn pretty tight with this that's what i like about this land all we can turn real tight here along here and then should we plant some more potato ground guys what do you guys think should we plant any more potato ground actually last year we had a ton of potatoes if we did plant more potato ground we would just sell the potatoes so what we do and to be honest i i bought a ropa you know the ropa potato harvester and then i literally just sold it so i'm gonna have to buy it back again this year because it was it was so much money dude it was like two hundred thousand dollars or something like that so i kind of just bought it and then just sold it real quick just so you guys know i want to i want to kind of be honest with you guys what i do and then this planner i bought it was a two hundred fifty thousand dollar planner so obviously so what i did is i added like two hundred and twenty thousand dollars so i did pay 30 grand worth it's just i don't know i i couldn't find another good planner out there i could have got a 7200 would have done the exact same thing but the 7200 in the game the 24 row 7200 it's just it's a tiny or it's not t a tiny planner it's it's a bad mod like it'll tip in the ground and it'll go all weird in the ground and stuff and i was like ah don't want to use that thing so that's why i paid two hundred thousand dollars more to get this nice one um yeah we'll live this bad boy up quick and then move around but dude i i do like this land all though i this is this is probably one of my favorite mods you know i don't really like like uh like tillage tools or like i don't really enjoy like planters and stuff i'm not like oh oh yeah. like when somebody asks what's your favorite mod in farm sim i'm not like oh yeah the planter no i usually say like a tractor or something or like a truck or something you know but this land all is it's a pretty good mod man um okay we're gonna lift her up and then should be good 78 10 she needs a bath dude we use this in so much it's only got 3.1 hours but uh it's basically brand new but i feel like i've used it so much drop her down there we go and then i don't 70 10 i always say I, I don't think i'll get rid of it like even if i got a 7r i'd still keep the 70 10 just because 70 10 is a lot smaller horsepower and we could throw a loader on this if we want but then we have a loader on the 4755 which we don't really need okay We'll fold her up quick. Go drop her off quick. Drop the land off. Uh, it's a little dirty. We'll probably use it again. So I'll, I'll, I'll keep it dirty. We'll keep it dirty. And then 7010, we're just going to floor it down to town and go pick up that planter. Um, we'll go through here. Okay. The potato planter is done over there too. What should we need to get out? I'm deciding whether I want to plant some more fields with potato. Potatoes? Maybe I could plant a strip down there. See that little strip? Maybe I could plant that with potatoes. That wouldn't be a bad idea. But I don't really need any more potatoes, so we should be good. Uh, pigs, I gotta. I, th I think the pigs need. Do the pigs need fed? Ooh, oh yeah, another little week, another little week right now. Okay, I gotta do chores too, and then we'll get the planter up here, and then we'll do chores, and then we need to. Okay, I, I'm okay. After this video, you're gonna see me skip a ton of days because we need to start skipping days so we can get to actually corn and soybean planting, um, and then maybe a live stream. We'll just go ham on planting. I'm thinking. Okay. Are we gonna be able to fit in here? I just kind of back everything in here. Okay, finally, the snow's starting to uh, starting to melt. There we go. We'll put that down. Okay, now we're booking it to town with my dirty 7810. We're just flying to town, baby. Here we go. And then I'll see you guys once we get there. Well.
There she is. She's shining green. Look at her. Holy crap. Yes. The 7810. No way. Okay, so it's it's got the like paint job. Like the weird weird like yellowish color. I hate this color. And it's not like John Deere yellow. It's like a shiny yellow and stuff. I hate it. But uh it'll work. It'll work good. It'll work good. Um okay, LBJ modding must have made it. Sweet. Okay, now I heard you can't hire out a worker with this. 7010's a little small. I mean, it's it, it's good enough to pull it back. You know, that's the thing. It should be good. Hopefully we should be good. And then the creator, or like the, the guy who posted it on the website said, like, it will kind of like bottom out if you go over some hills and stuff. So I gotta watch out for that. Um, okay, we're gonna keep backing up a little more. Come on. There we go. Sweet. We'll hook up to her. Oh, okay. We're hooked up. There we go, 7010, she sat back a little bit. Look how dirty it is, dude. Oh, dude, look at it. It is a lot of weight. Holy crap, okay, watch this. It sits back, dude, look at that. Okay, I probably shouldn't just be automatically detaching that, but oh, dude, those front tires, they're spinning a little bit, not gonna lie. Okay. Oh, dude, we gotta unfold it. I gotta see what it looks like unfold. Okay, so how many rows is it, technically? One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, it's twelve because the middle bar's right here. Oh, and what we could do is we could pull like uh, an hydra's tank or something like that because I saw it doing that, dude. This is a sweet mod. I love this mod, dude. Okay, well we haven't really even began to use it yet. Okay, there's no way the seventy ten could pull it. I think the seven R could though. I don't know. Maybe even the 9400. 9, maybe we need the 9400 for this thing. This thing is huge, dude. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're going to pull through here. We're going to get going. It takes a 7810 a little while to get going, dude. Okay, maybe that's because I'm folding it up right now. It's probably because I'm folding it up. It's it's really having a challenge. There we go. Yeah, now once we got it folded. Okay, she, she starts going a little bit. But dude, holy crap. The new planner is huge. I, oh, I took out the side. I couldn't even make that turn because I couldn't swing that wide there. Oh my gosh, wait. Okay, I was like, what is up with this view? Oh wait, am I like in, dude, I think I have a view that's inside of the planter right now. This is cool. This is a cool view. Like my view is from the middle of the planter right now. See how I'm steering the 7810? It's like, it's tough to even like tell where I'm going. But this, oh my gosh, I'm kind of going all over the road. There we go. It's so weird having this view like this. Like I can't, it's, I don't know. I, I don't know if you guys understand this, but this is super weird for me. <laughs> the 7810 just keeps like moving, shaking a lot. <laughs> okay, we better put this baby on cruise control and start rolling up here. Dude, this is a cool view. I love this view. This is a big planner though, dude. I, we're gonna, it's either 7R or 9400. Now the 9400, it's a little old for this planner because this planner is kind of a new planner. But, holy crap, we're losing speed. We're losing speed. Come on. Oh dude, we're only going 20. We're struggling. Come on, dude, this view. Oh, dude, this is sweet. I like this view. I, I like this view. We're going 16 mile an hour right now, guys. 16 mile an hour. We are going to need a lot of power for this planner, I feel like. This is a big planner, dude. Keep climbing. Keep climbing, 7810. Come on. I told you guys we need the 7810. Dude, the comments, it would have had a tough time pulling up this hill, man. Holy crap, we're going 15 mile an hour right now. I'm literally on cruise control. Got it set at 24 mile an hour right now. Keep climbing, dude. Okay, this is the last. This is like the steepest grade. We should be good. Don't drop to 13. I thought we just popped a wheelie there for a second. Okay, we're gaining speed. We're gaining speed. There we go. There we go, baby. We're gaining speed up here. Okay, sweet. I'll get back to you guys once I get up there. Dude, you just hear the 7010 just roaring, trying to get up these hills. It's just taking a tough time. I'm really digging this view that we got going here. What's nice, oh dude, look at this. You can literally climb up there. To, that's how you fill those seed boxes and stuff. Or obviously you're gonna have a seed tender or something like that. But dude, this is sweet. Holy crap, yeah, we definitely need a bigger tractor. 7010, I'm thinking it's too small. I'm kind of leaning towards the 9400, but we'll see kind of what you guys say. Right now, like I said, I was going to feed the pigs, so we're going to feed the pigs. We're going to just drop this baby off in the front yard. We have, like, all of our equipment just scattered in the front yard, which I've been getting a lot of comments on lately to start cleaning up a little better. I'm going to work on that, Um, but we got to... Uh, pigs are more important right now. So, uh, ooh, shoot. 
Okay, we gotta get out little blue because the 4755 is hooked up to the planner. And of course, we're just gonna grab the gravity wagons again and just do the exact same thing. Grab all the feed. Do we have all the feed though? Man, I hope we have all the feed. I think all our gravity wagons are back here too yet. Sweet, they're all connected too. Okay. We don't use little blue too much. Or actually, you know what? I feel like it's been a lot of videos. It's been a lot of thumbnails in my videos lately. Um, okay. There we go. Sweet. I think I'll always keep little blue around. Now, everybody's been saying little blue's too small to do stuff, man. Dude, little blue can run the auger. It can, uh, it can, okay, well, we're going to run the square baler with it. Or we're going to, like, do, we're going to use it for hay, for sure. We got to use it for hay. Um, I don't know what it'll run. Will it run the little square baler? We could let it run the little square baler. I think that'd be good. Or the 4755 over there. Um, it looks like we do have the potatoes planted. Oh, one thing I said I was going to do is I said I was going to roll this field. I don't know if it's realistic to roll the field just right after it gets some plant especially with potatoes i feel like that's only soybeans but uh we may we may just do her okay fill with wheat why not we're gonna need some wheat okay let's stop that fill with uh soybeans good we're gonna need some soybeans good enough okay sweet we're gonna pull out of here quick yeah dude a little blue she's got a tough time pulling out of here sometimes um, okay we'll just pull through here just start unloading this i'll just pull right next up to it oh boy oh boy oh boy um can we unload there we go oh shoot i was like i kind of scared myself for a second i accidentally hit oh i was like oh what is that <laughs> it like kind of just i like flinched for a second oh yeah um there we go unload that back stuff quick drop her down okay so we are completely full with that let's see what else we need water straw corn potatoes we need potatoes man potatoes we have a lot of potatoes. We have fifty-six thousand. It doesn't even use that many potatoes. You know what? I should start getting. Uh, I should start getting more pigs, like a crap ton of pigs. Our pigs aren't doing crap. Oh wait, you know what? They did. Pr they did reproduce because we were at thirty-one, I think. So we did get two pigs. Hey, we got some baby pigs. Hey, I didn't even announce that to you guys. Maybe I should start announcing that more. We need to have like a journey that's like just getting pigs to reproduce. Maybe I should buy like two hundred pigs. Okay, we don't have the money for that, but I wish. I wish. I wish. Um. Let's unload it. Okay, we're unloading the back. And then we'll unload the front. I need to start stop filling these things so full. I need yeah. Uh, they just fill up so fast so fast. I need to just Okay, we'll go back. Start filling oh shoot. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. We'll go corn and then stop filling. Okay, good, good, good. Holy crap. Dude, these things want to fill so quick. Potatoes. Okay. Good. There we go. We definitely don't need that much, but we got it anyways. Little blue, she gets a little workout. She stretches the legs a little bit, especially when we're pulling these gravity wagons. Okay. We'll just pull in right here. I feel like I need a more efficient way of doing this. I feel like this is pretty efficient, but I feel like we could do a little better. Um, Unload here. They're getting their corn. Wow, they actually kind of need a lot of corn. Oh, gosh. I always hit that button on accident. <laughs> okay. We'll... Okay. Oh my. That's all the potatoes you guys needed. That's it. That's it, man. Okay. We'll just pull through here and just un dump all of this out in here. And then I'm thinking what we could do is uh, we need straw yet. I need to get that straw shredder. The bale shredder is what I really need to do. There's so many things I really need to do. But uh, we're going to unload this. Corn is. Oh, wait. Okay. There we go. And then unload potatoes quick. And then we need to start loading. Let's start loading. What else do we have? Start filling some straw and water is going to be it. But you guys know straw. I have to pull around here. Good. Okay. Definitely good. Wait, we're redumping. We oh, okay. Okay. Well, hey, I, we have some straw left. I accidentally like start dumping it out. For straw, we got to pull all the way around here and it's back on those fans. I would pull that way, but it, these wagons unload on the left. So I kind of got to pull all the way around here. There's going to be a lot of corn. We got to clean up the corn yet too. Um, okay, it's, I think it's this fan right up here. Or is it the next fan? Oh. Oh wait, did I see something? Oh no, I think it's this middle fan maybe. Oh wait, there we go. We got unload symbol. Sweet. Okay, we're good with straw. And then I'm just gonna put this away. I do have to get water yet, and then clean up the corn. And we should be good. Pull a little blue in through here. Sweet. And then let that bad boy unload. Okay, there we go. 
And anyways, guys, this is going to be the end. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy it. I need to know 9400 or the 7310. What's it going to be? Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Hey, I'll see you guys later. Thanks, guys.